It's good to see you. Um, how are you now? The film is almost upon us, the anticipation and the reaction. What are you kind of nervous or anxious about? Nothing. Nothing. No nerves. No. no nerves. No. The time of nerves is done. Yeah. <laughs> it's upon us now. Yeah. It's we're excited. That's, that's on you. Yeah, yeah. You're nervous. I'm not, we're not I'm nervous. Not, I've seen, I'm excited, actually. Yes. Maybe Ryan's nervous, yeah. but yeah. I'm not. I'm yeah. not yeah. nervous. Yeah. I'm, I'm eager and, and happy that it's coming out. Yeah. yeah. It's, a mo it's, a, it's a lot of excitement. Mm. And, you know, once you see the final product, that was, that's always the most surprising thing is what actually made it. Um, yeah. To the cut, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Have you guys yeah. seen it already? Yeah. I'm sorry to. He has, I haven't. I haven't. What? Why? Because I don't it? feel ready. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. And will, are you going to see it today? Today? No. Okay. No. Oh, that's interesting. I'll see it in good time. In good time. I understand that. We poured everything into it. Yeah. So you'll see when you when you when you watch it. If, if you haven't watched. I've it. watched it. Ah, then you watch it so you understand. Yeah, I do. I All really right. do understand. Um, what was it like getting back into character? Well, I would say that it was very, very different. We were dealing with a very different set of circumstances. We'd lost Chadwick Boseman, and that changed everything. Mm -hmm. You know, he was very much the center of our narrative and, mm -hmm. um, and a dear friend, and it was um, hard. Mm -hmm. Very, very discombobulating to lose him in such a surprising way. Mm -hmm. um, and so uh, it took, yeah, it took it took something to to show back up to Wakanda, but the gift that is Ryan is that he made this story about loss. Mm -hmm. So we could really show up in a, with our full selves, with our grief, and put mm -hmm. that grief to work. Mm -hmm. uh, and so embodying Nakia is was a, I I had to come to Nakia with her having lost her love. You mm -hmm. know what I mean, the love of her life, which is mm -hmm. a. I mean, I can't even begin to imagine what that is uh, is like. Um, and, you know, she has matured a lot. Life circumstances have changed for her, and she's taken it on in a, in a surprising way. I don't want to ruin it for fans, uh, but she's still someone you call when you're in an hour. Like getting back into Jabari's... Um, Mbaku, you Mbaku. Mean. Why am I saying it? Right, the Jabari tribe. Yes, I said that, didn't I? Oh, Sorry, it's it's Mbaku. Right. I got you. Okay, all right. so I like getting back into <laughs> because he's, he's got the comedic element. Mm. So whilst you're grieving, and there's that, I don't want to say seriousness, but that. T you know, um, it was all such a surprise. Like the entire, like setting the scene of it all. It, it was all such a surprise to learn of Chadwick's passing, and then. Dealing with that, everything that came from there was a surprise. So reading the script for the first time was a surprise. Mm -hmm. Getting back on set and getting, like it, it just wasn't the same. You know, all of it was just completely different. Um, being in M'Baku's skin again, it was great to bring some of the levity and, and, and um, humor um, I think the way he uses humor is, is to weaponize it so he can be very honest and, and clear in the moment. Um, he, he can be both reverent and irreverent at the same time, and that's a really cool thing. Um, and it, it was fun to kind of bring that into scenes and make everyone laugh. I and mean, the guys on the cameras were like laughing between takes, and it was, it's a good feeling to be able to do that and have that be a little bit of a, an off from feeling sad because mm -hmm. that's what was happening as well as we were feeling sad in between takes and feeling sad on those days, you know. Thank you so much.